brand tech here where tech is made simple. So Microsoft is currently integrating the OpenAI chatbot called ChatGPT as I have been posting into their newly redesigned Bing search engine. And as I did post yesterday, are now releasing the ChatGPT powered Bing to users on the waitlist who originally signed up to the waitlist like I did, which means, as I mentioned in that video, which I'll leave a link to uh, in the description, uh, this means only select users have access to the service currently. So basically, the long and the short, it's on a controlled rollout. Now, after posting and also posting previous videos, I've had a lot of comments on the channel where users and viewers are asking, how can I get access to the new Bing with the ChatGPT? I've signed up to the waiting list. I've gone through Microsoft's instructions on how to get it earlier and get early access, but I still haven't seen it. Now, basically, just a quick video to answer that question, because Microsoft um, over on Twitter uh, recently has given us the reasons why you are not seeing the new Bing with ChatGPT yet. So just to have a look at this tweet, and this may answer that question. They say uh, they are currently in limited preview so that we can test, learn, and improve. We're slowly scaling people off the waitlist daily. So that means that it's on a controlled rollout. So if you did sign up to the waiting list, it will be in phases. So if you don't see it today, you might see it tomorrow. So it's a phased controlled rollout. If you're on the waitlist, just hang tight, Microsoft says. As we said at launch, we intend to scale to millions of people beginning in the coming weeks. We're only one week in. So um, this was originally expected to start um, at the beginning of February and then more or less finalized by the end of March. So as mentioned, one week in. So there are still a couple of weeks to go. They say they are prioritizing those with Bing and Edge as their default search engine and browser as well as the Bing mobile app installed to optimize the initial experience. Over time, they intend to bring it to all browsers. They carry on to say demand is high with multiple millions now on the wait list. And as I did post previously, in 48 hours, there were a million signups to the waiting list for uh, the new uh, Bing chat GPT powered search engine. So because of this, obviously demand is high. So they basically ask for a little patience if you just join the wait list. They carry on to say they are testing with people in 169 countries and seeing a lot of engagement with new features like chat. And um, basically that's Microsoft's reason and explanation over on Twitter where they tweeted recently why um, you may not have uh, received the new Bing with the chat GPT powered a chatbot using artificial intelligence yet uh, in your web browser and on your device. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.